use a lot of spinal decompression, as we call it, which is a fancy term for traction on a computer. And we do this because we're looking to maximize the improvement and the function of the spine. This is an example of the human spine, and we're looking at the low back, the lumbar spine, move in this direction with time. And this is how we do it. <clears throat> You'll see that Lottie has a strap around her rib cage. She has another one around the lumbar spine and the abdomen, the pelvis. And these two straps pull apart very gently to take pressure off of that disc. We only pull enough to achieve that effect without overdoing it and aggravating the patient. So we want to have just the right amount. We want to pull enough to take pressure off the disc, but we don't want to over pull and then aggravate the surrounding tissue. Now, as this process goes forward, we're essentially pulling the vertebrae apart, holding for about a minute, and then releasing it, and then pulling back, and then releasing it. So the spine is being pulled and released like an accordion. This has a great effect on pulling fresh fluids into the disc, pushing stagnant fluids out of the disc, and allowing it to heal with more efficiency. We have very good results with this treatment. We have a high success rate with it and we often use it for neuropathy care as well because it's very common for someone with neuropathy to have a chronic back condition or someone with a chronic back condition to have neuropathy, although the two can exist individually without one or the other. So this is another modality we use at our clinic at Hansgrove Functional Neurology and uh, we, we help a lot of people with it. I thank you for watching this video and look forward to meeting you sometime soon. Free screening. Call today.